Perishable food is defined as those that spoil, decay or become unfit for consumption because they have a limited shelf life after harvest or production. These include meat, poultry, fish, dairy products, produce and cooked meals. They require special storage conditions and have to be transported in clean temperature controlled containers. This is essential to maintain the quality of these items when they are moved from their place of production to the market and the end consumer. Each food type has its own handling requirements because of its varying shelf life. Therefore, it's something to keep in mind to ensure you can handle shipping conditions. The easiest way to transport perishable items is by air. However, it has its own limitations. Air cargo transport is expensive when compared with road, rail or sea transport. And for this reason, it may not be economically viable to transport a large volume of cargo by air. When transporting by sea, which is a cost-effective solution, there are two options a reefer cargo ship and by using a refrigerated container. Reefer ships are specialized cargo vessels designed specifically for transporting perishable goods such as fruits, vegetables and seafood. These ships are equipped with refrigeration systems that maintain a controlled temperature inside the ship's cargo holds, ensuring the preservation of the perishable goods during transportation. However, transporting perishable cargo by temperature-controlled intermodal cargo containers by sea is the most preferred method when cargo volumes and cost have to be considered. Reefer containers are insulated shipping containers equipped with portable temperature control equipment, temperature monitoring and data logging devices. The temperature within such containers may be set at the desired level to maintain the quality of the cargo. This would depend on the type of cargo being transported and as prescribed by the producer or manufacturer of the item. Refrigerated containers are used to transport meat and seafood at minus 30 degrees Celsius. The same containers may be used to move ambient food items at 24 degrees Celsius after the necessary cleaning of the container. Condensation is a major cause of deterioration and spoilage of perishable goods as well as their packaging. Hence, all efforts have to be taken to ensure that condensation does not form during the loading and unloading of the cargo. This is when it is most susceptible to condensation as there is a difference in the temperature between the warehouse and the cargo container. Other key factors that have to be taken into consideration while sending perishable cargo by sea freight are Timing, which is very important while shipping perishable items, waiting time at port, waiting for customs clearance, transport etc. have to be factored in while calculating the overall lead time. Better routes should be chosen for the movement of perishable goods. Perishable goods with their limited shelf lives should be dropped off and picked up exactly as planned. The products being shipped must be clean and their packages should be intact. Damaged or leaking packages can lead to contamination and spoilage. A thorough cleaning ensures that the container does not have any odors that might catch on to other cargo such as food items. Even the grooves of the door frame must be clean to ensure that the door closes and seals the container perfectly. An important factor while sending perishable cargo is to provide clear instructions to those handling the goods. Labels showing handling and storage instructions can help in preserving the quality and condition of perishable cargo. Have you ever worked on a reefer cargo ship or refrigerated containers? Let us know in the comments. And for more such information, follow Marine Insight.